Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Revenger2 here. Today, we're going to simulate the World Cup final match against France and Argentina and see if it is... See if FIFA 23 can reproduce the same Hello, magic that Argentina did in the World Cup the final this previous time of time. So, I will not be playing, it is just the AI, the AI will be playing by themselves, hopefully the game will register, you know that, um, so me, I was over ecstatic when Argentina won because that, that made Messi, they gave Messi uh, the World Cup win, and you know, that's what he's been after this entire time, so without further ado guys, uh, we're going to let the game play here, and I'm going to commentate, you know, here and there. And let's see what we can, what we can get into, you know. It's always very interesting to hear each country's national anthem. Um, that's always one of the best moments in football. You know, I, I do enjoy football myself. So let's see what see if the game the can be fixed. Starting Emilio lineup Martinez for Argentina that can be around at four three three. Acuna, Osmani, Romero, Molina, Fernandez, Paredes, De Paul, Di Maria, Alvarez, and Messi. Um, Di Maria and Messi on the wings. One striker at top, they're gonna to run a 4 3 3, which is common, or the most common diff common lineup. Let's see what France is going to run. France will also side. run a 4 3 3. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Antoine Griezmann Hernandez, starts alongside Adrian Rabio in the center Mikano, of the park. And this Nate, tactical setup, they have Rabio, just one player Kumiane, in attack. Griezmann, Mbappe, Mwani, Coman. But uh, the French midfield is a lot more condensed. Uh, it's a lot more things. So let's get it started. Begins. Let's get the action started right now. The Argentinians are immediately are starting to attack Di here Maria. off the flank with Di Maria. I mean, press early, get that early goal, get out of the way, and see what happens. Options in the center. It is on legendary AI, um, so the AI is what it should be on. It should be on Di Maria. what the game Elements thinks they would act like in real, real life. So this is them. Up, uh, go, go past, go past, but too early for that cut. Still too fresh. Well, the just looking at everything in Lionel Messi's impressive repertoire, Stuart, it is considerable. What do you think will be especially relevant this time around? Well, the best players can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in Not tight in areas. Area. Around the box. Creativity space. is excellent. Playing little one twos, balls around the corner, linking up with right, other teammates. Just to have that little bit of penetration. Messi. He's going to be key to breaking down the defense. Mike Mike Paul. Front. Back to Fernandez. Goal! Argentina lead by one to nil. Oh. I've seen like this one's been put to bed pretty early. Oh, right. That's well, right. Almost. Look at this guy. Get some space. Really but he, 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 defended, he lost his defender, lost goes. his mark. And then he slotted into the bottom left corner away from the keeper. The keeper left too much of the left side of the net open. But, you know, that's, that's keeping. You know, you got to make a choice. And they get it started. And France get the ball moving again. Can they come up with an answer here? All right. I have an immediate attack with Mbappe on the wing here. Cutting inside, cutting inside. They really want to equalize it really quickly. Not going to happen. Timely Might be bad. Need some more time for it to develop. So, what do you guys think of the World Rodrigo Cup this, this year? Like all of the World Cup matches, uh, because honestly, it was very interesting to see some underdogs in there. Fernandez. Um, 
Return How far did your team get? You know. There wasn't much on that offside decision. Could have been in business. Uh, a little bit offside. A little bit offside. There. So what, what what team were you pulling for? Were you pulling for Argentina? Were you pulling for France? Spain? Portugal? You know? You know, honestly, I was pulling for Germany, you know, but uh, they just haven't had the same team as they as the 2014 the team. team. And they did win. Um, but hey, it was life. You know, just, just stay, stay committed to them. The and, you know, they'll eventually find their way back to the um, World Cup Finals. Fernandez. De Paul. Now with Messi. With nothing going on for right now, just know that the I will be doing the simulations well for the Women's in World the Cup and with the same night starts up. So mainly we'll start it done around the 16. Kunde. Because then we can follow around with the round 16 exactly how it should be and what teams are. And he read it well. What teams are there, or we'll just do the, the finals, or we'll do our own tournament. Messi. You know, to see what see which team would actually win within their tournament. So, you know, so like I said, we we'll, we'll, I'll decide when it gets much closer to the Women's World Cup in, in July, June, July, in August, I do believe. Don't put me on when it starts. I have no idea. Right I'll have a good look. And so we'll simulate those matches as well and see if our results will match Alvarez. up to the women's results you know in, momentum here, in the conference can they so produce? see what we got ah uh, never going to be the keeper with that one. just because it's close he's always he's falling that way close doesn't get you a goal it only counts in hand shoes hand, Horseshoes and hand grenades. It only close only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades. I almost messed up that quote because I've been, I've been doing my first job, you know, and come home and well, do no this. Him. So, yeah. All right, France got their first corner of the match. Right, let's see who's going to take it. What Let's about lost his shot. It, it's it on track now. to go in. It might have hit the post. Who knows? All right. So we have Griezmann taking the corner with the, his left foot. Now sending it in. Ooh, oh, that was good. That was, that was a good header right there. How he almost came in. Thank goodness for the keeper on that one. Oh, it would have been all knotted up at 1-1. Again, Griezmann will be taken with his left. With Not as good corner. of a free kick. Well, as a defender, probably needs to be cleared out. In position here and to then play back, the which is good. You know, give your time, give your offense, Fernandez. your strikers, and your midfielders time to get up the pitch. On to Messi. Alvarez. Keep it on the wings, make it wide, keep it wide, give it some area. You can't do that right now. Play it too far inside. Should have played it on his left foot instead. Ah, oh, you're not going to beat the keeper the like keeper that. Too, too narrow, too the narrow. Ball. If you see watching the replay here, he's just pushing too much to the left and closing that angle down. So it's not enough. But, they, but Argentina did get a corner. Let's see. Let's see who's going to take it. We have Messi taking it with his left foot in swinging. Playing it in. Oh, that's a good, that's a good block. block. A good header as well. Um, all right, time for France to counter attack here. Let's see what Mwani can do on the wing. Okay, we're gonna play it inside to Rabio. For Fernandez, to Mbappe, Griezmann to Coman. Coman is on the wing here, he's gonna get it kicked out. Be another French corner. That is three French well, corners. The Argentinians won. Look at this save, yeah. And this is a very typical and very easy, easy save. 
Griezmann's going to take it on his left. Another in swinging kick. And it's cleared by the Argentines. But it's right back into play by the French. Let's see if the French can do a test. Goal by Kylian Mbappe. That was a good technical play by them. Like forcing the ball back in the box and then giving it to Mbappe and letting him hit with his right away from the keeper. Just look at that. It all And that ball is flowing away from the keeper. Just so the keeper doesn't have... I don't think the ball is supposed to be doing that much spinning, but okay. Video games. Level pegging, one goal apiece Unless in Mbappe is spinning that like like Hot Wheels. Let's see if the Argentinians can respond with a goal before halftime. The half minutes are set like six minutes in, 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 IRL, in IRL time. So it gives plenty of time for action. I don't want to sit here for all day. Uh, the the, the referee is going to play advantage here. So let's let the referee play advantage and let's get it going on. Move this you know, I, I like when the referees play advantage and doesn't just stop plays immediately. But, really but yeah, sticking sometimes to the they need to if it gets, does get too physical. Um, because, uh, yeah, got to. All right, it seems like the Argentinians are going to back build. Two minutes of and, stoppage you know, time. That gets some depth and some width in this attack here. You can't just keep it inside. Messi. You know, we got to see. Uh, okay, the the French knocked it out. Two minutes of stoppage end. time is about up. And that's halftime, guys. Well, the first half story has been written. It's halftime. So here's here the first the time Arena. highlights coming at you from. Well, the on Kylian Mbappe. Here's in Kylian a word Mbappe. He won a well, they at their one best, goal. But with that that's good average. That's a good. That's good percentage so shooting. So it's one one. Fernandez with the nine minute so goal and Mbappe with the 40th minute goal. We're all knotted up at one all. All right, so let's enjoy some highlights begins. from the first half, from the first 45. Might jump in front. Real chance. There it is. A nice just the ideal start. low kick to, to the post there by the, the Argentinians. The keeper never had a chance on that one. If that, that if the ball would have snuck inside the cross, crossbar there, on the side, it, it would have, it, it would have went in, and the keeper was diving low. But this header right here almost resulted in a goal. Almost. But you know, keeper stuck his big palm out and knocked it away for another corner. And the keeper flings himself at the ball. The keeper read that one all the way in, so he used his palm to knock it out. Good and this right is just a France. master class of passing and, and, and just striking it. one touch. And it is the equalizer, parity now. And who's to say what's going to So here's your first half stats possession 57% to the Argentinians, 43 to the French. Seems like it's a bit, bit even here, so that's good. All right, let's resume the match. Let's get to the second half. Kick off. Let's go. Into the second half, then, and these two see sides. If, see who can break this game together. open here. Just can't really choose between them at the moment. And if you're a soccer or a football fan, you know, either choice of words, you, you can dis you can tell me what position you played. Well, that's how to keep the opposition you this at far into the video. Let's turn it off. So, what position did you play? Fernandez. Striker, now, what can they midfielder, do winger, uh, defender, you know, keeper, you know, towel boy. No, I'm joking. Um, Mbappe. You know, because I play a mix of uh, defender Coma. and uh, striker. Killian Mbappe. Um, in, in university myself, so. A very timely interception. De Paul. Nice attack to build in from the Argentinians. Get some depth, get some now width in the, within the attack, you know. Good, good, good Messi. passing, you know. Get some How width, get some, get, try here. to cross, you need to cross. Big cross. You can't just keep dribbling, you know. And I mean, that's that, why you get the ball taken. Take the ball back. Di Maria. 
I have to lay the ball off. Okay, now it's time for the first counter attack. Let's see what Kylian they can Mbappe. do for the counter. So that they're going to go all the way and go. Muani, number seven. Muani well, with the again. goal that has the just the put the French side so in the lead. Like I said, the, the French right were counter-attacking and, and the keeper had no shot at that one. It was close range, low. Yeah, the only keeper was the hope and pray that that would have went wide or he would have shanked it with his foot. So Muani is now off. So on with the match. Two now see if the Argentinians can play What's with much more next? hurry in, in their step. Now well Molina. Fernandez. So tell me Di guys Maria. if uh, in the future you want to see Plenty more of those. Of who, what two teams here, you want, want to see? Produce. You want me to see a, the lowest ranked team on FIFA 23 face the Alvarez. most, the, the toughest team? Or do you want to see random matches between countries that you never thought you would see? Like, for well, example, see, had much less uh, the, the Chinese men's team versus the United States men's team really because so uh, they've actually never faced each other. Oh, well, good, shot, good shot, good shot, good shot. Close. Well, I'm not sure how he's missed the target from there. That's a poor effort. And it is substitution time at this juncture, not just from one side. I seem like the Argentinians are making a tactical substitution, and they're going to make a substitution to give them more strength in the attacking portion of the field because they need the goal to tie it up to force overtime. He's lost it. Coman. Or, you know, man. going back to my point, well, so can, going back to, to my ball, point here, you know, we can simulate matches to see, you know, in, a, in our own FIFA tournament, we can just randomly pull now teams, you know, I can do, I can do a random, random generator of countries, and, um, Cross blocked. and there, and we can put them in the World Cup, and we'll see which team will win the World Cup. This, on this game, this, it's just hypothetical. Mm. Now, Always we? going away, off balance on that one. So, let's see. We'll take it on his left foot. It'll be an out swinging kick. Out swinging kicks are normally easier we'll to defend than in swingers because in swingers have the opportunity Acuna. to ricochet. And to, for, for the defended, for defending team to knock to into their own goal. But that didn't happen because it was an outside. Great defending uh, here. It was an, Martinez. Textbook defending the ball was bending away from the goal. So, yeah. Let's just clarify the injury situation. Our man on the side of the pitch is Jeff Only Shreves. a few more minutes. I really out time. Really 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 can the French get another goal? Oh, or can the Argentine level really it up you've got to say. before the end? Clear foul play. And as a result, a free kick forthcoming. Looks like the referee did stop it for, for, a, for a foul. And the, Argent, or the French side will take a free kick. And Griezmann will take it and knock him through the box and see what happens. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. Inside, can counter attack and just All hands on strip deck. the ball off the field. For a counter to succeed, they need some magic. They need a miracle. It didn't. They need a goal at the least level. They have to knock things back up. Lionel Messi. So let's, let's see that they're pressing. A little bit more than in the French are. The French are more in a defensive stature, which is so they're not as attacking as much, but they still will attack when they have the ball and they will possess. But they're not going to go that that fast. Oh, the French side almost put this game out of reach for the Argentinians because that would have been goal number three, but that wasn't goal number three. 
He's mad as a team because they're not marking. So, yeah. Sometimes zone marking can bite you like that. So, don't always zone mark. Sometimes you got to man mark once they get inside that box. Who can he pick out? Another out swinging kick. It's the keepers. So, there's no, so there's no issue there. This Argentinian side needs to hurry. Just 10 minutes remaining here. Or, or this French side will take the imaginary World Martinez. Cup this time. And here they come, still pressing for an equaliser. Chance to play it in. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Can the Argentinian just find the last minute measure? Or can the French there, side just slow the, the pace down? Can and not hit so on the, the Argentinians can't get that equalizer. He's in with a chance. Marcos Acuna. And in your Paredes. mind, what was the best moment of the 2022 World Cup? Was it Messi finally winning it? Or was it the fact that Portugal got eliminated? Brazil got eliminated? And here's Dembele. What, a, what was your favorite moment? Tell me down in the comments below. And if you did like the video, like, comment, subscribe for more from videos this like this would in, in all the likelihood secure victory. Now the second Mbappe is going off right now. But he's done for the day. There's no reason to run him dry because it's about to be over. Take it short. Short, short kick because there's no point. It's a waste of some time. Perfect example of how to put in a tackle, and a corner will be next. They're going to go short again, probably because waste time and just you know they need the. F Taking short. Yeah, that's all the French really need. Right they don't need to even attack now. They just hold the ball, and not do anything. And that's it. The and game is over, and the French side have won the 2023 rematch World Cup. And now they are the official victors, and Stuart, there will be no penalty shootout. Well, you know, there will be no nail by the penalty shootout. You know, and, and in my mind, it should have never went to penalty kicks. It should have went to just golden goal. They played until someone scored. Golden goal style. He I don't, he was always it, in my the opinion, game, they should have just let them goal. play that was for three hours straight. Today. And if there's still no winner at the, at the at that point, you know, to let them play until someone scores. You know, go on goal style. Because penalties, yes, while it does take skill, in my mind, golden goal would have been a lot more interesting. Because I'll then you would what, actually have to do the And it, it, it wouldn't come down to, come down to, a, something that that some people are really good at versus some people are some of the players oh, a good diving save. but that has been your game these are the end match highlights guys like I said this has been a simulation I have not touched the controller one time um, so I have not played as friends I have not played at ball. Argentina if I had played at Argentina I would have probably made them win but you know hey good move in the making from France Oh, this during this match, what was your favorite goal as well? And it is the, equalizer. the one from Mbappe was pretty nice. what's But next? I think in the future, Mbappe Kono and the French Mouani. side will be another force to reckon with at the, ne at the next World Cup in 2026. And, and you know, He's they were they're going to continue this hot streak. Yeah, moment. they had an off year. But, you know, by their standards, because they didn't win back-to-back -back, um, World here. Cups, but Mbappe well, still has a great a future ahead of him. He's the next Messi. He's well, the I'm next sure Ronaldo. The you know, because, and he, yeah, and he's the next Neymar because so unlike Neymar, space. Mbappe actually has more no skills. So these are the final results, guys. Argentina 1, France 2. 
Thank you for joining me on this video. Enjoy it. See you on the next one.